finally, it took you forever. So, are we gonna do... Are we gonna do show jumping or what? Okay. There are three jumps, and we have to... And it's like a time, a time thing. So, what we're gonna have to do is... Well, I'll demonstrate. We have to, we only have about we have thirty three seconds to complete this course. Come on, Joel, we can do this, bro. That's okay, Joel. So what I'm saying is it's a bit like Jim Kaya. The fastest person wins. That's easy. Okay. I'll go. Come on, Twinkle. girl come on twinkle let's go girl Let's see how Miss Ruby does on this. Ruby, let's go back. You did really good. <sighs> Ruby worked up a sweat. All right, come on, girl. It's our turn. How is Blossom ever going to make that, Lizzie? Well, she can do it. I just know it. Come on, girl. Let's go on tack. I think we did enough jumping for today. Lizzie's right. Let's go on tack. Our horses are getting really tired and we need to put them in past in the pasture. Anyways, we need to go grab their a few of their foals. Uh, okay, let's go then. Come on, Ruby. Mm. Mm. Don't fight. 
Come on, Joel, let's get your blanket on. Oh, I forgot it. I hope Madison's coming tomorrow for Christmas. Yeah, hope. We all do. Madison's our sister. Well, no, she's more of our friend, actually. She's like a sister. Mom only had us four. <laughs> Joel, your blanket is so heavy. <laughs> Feels like 200 pounds of concrete. For you, sis. Not for her. That may be true. Alright, let's get all our other horses untacked. Now let's get your blanket on, girl. Okay, what are you doing that now? Jewel's blanket is all on. So is Ruby's. Let's go put them in the paddock then. Okay. Come on, Jewel girl. Come on, Jewel baby. Ruby.
All right, let's get your blanket on Tulip. Oh. Your old name was Tulip. Hmm. Oh, your foal's name was Tulip. Wait, no, your mom's name was Tulip. God, you're forgetting God. All right, girl, let's get you into the paddock. Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's undo your saddle. There we go. Okay, I just went to go put your tack away. No, we'll go get your blankie. All right, I got your blanket on. Now let's take you to paddock. Or to the paddock pasture anyway. Oh. Let's go. Blossom, would you please move out of the way? You were the one who knocked me down. Duh. No, I wasn't. Oh, my God. All right, let's go get the fools now. Spirit buddy. Yay, mommy is in the paddock. Yay. Uh, ow. All right. He's out. Come on, Sparkle baby. Turn, Miss Rosie. All right, we got all them out. We don't want no one get hurt. <gasps> Sparkle! <sighs> Blossom, look what your filly of yours did to mine. Are you okay, sweetie? I'm fine, Mom. We're just playing. Well, you're not playing with her anymore. She's too rough. Now, wait one second. My full, my Rosie is not too rough. All right, sweetie, you go play with Spirit. Okay, Mommy. Ooh, I'll go with her. No, you will not. I do not want my baby being picked on. Um, now, Ruby, they really were just being colts. I mean, fillies. I used to have a colt of my own. Now, they were just being fillies. So there's no big issue. No big issue? Oh, my goodness. Well, there really was no big issue. Well, what do you call pinning her to the ground? I call it fools being fools. 
For goodness gracious, they're just playing. Fine. I'll leave it this once. Rosie! Yeah, Mama? You can go play with her again. Sparkle again. Okay, Mom. Can I play with you guys too? Sure, Spirit. Everybody's welcome. Yeah. Come on. I think we should go somewhere. Mama? Yeah? Can we slip under the fence and go somewhere? Um, where is that somewhere? It's a secret. Well, it better not be far from here, okay? Okay, Mom. Can I go to mommy? Okay, fine. A few minutes later. Mama? Yeah? Um, I don't know how to say this. Did you get hurt? No, no, that's not that. Oh no, my baby got hurt. I told you this was a bad idea. You didn't tell me anything. Well, who hurt you? No one. I bet it was that Rosie again. Now, one minute. She did not hurt her. And besides, she never hurt her at all. What do you call pinning her to the ground? You already said that a long time ago. I don't care, but, she, but Sparkle must have got pinned to the ground again. By your baby. Mama, that's not what happened. Oh, yes, it is. You just said it. No, you said it for me, and that's not what happened. Oh, darling, come here. Mommy? Am I in trouble? No, you're not. I know that wasn't what happened. Thank you, Mama. Come on, let's go. Come on, baby girl, come over here. Okay, Mama. Ugh. Mama, I've had enough of this. I'm going to my Mama. Oh, Mama. Mommy, Mommy. Bum, get over here. Ugh. What do you want, darling? What do you need, honey? To give you this. Excuse me? You never listen to me. Because you always tell me you got hurt. I don't. That's a lie, Mom. What we saw out there, there was a cougar. And he's headed this way now. I'm sorry, darling. I'm sorry too much. Oops. Sorry, Mom. Oof. It was an accident. Can I, uh... Okay. Now, we gotta warn the humans. Okay, Mama. Nay and Winnie. Come on, Mares, let's Winnie. <laughs> Guys, what is it? I know 
just kill Cuckoo coming. And he can't get in anymore. He just blocked off the fence. Never mind, Dan. Oh, honey, it's okay. Never mind, then. It's okay, honey. I know more. Well, at least tomorrow's Christmas. Mm -hmm. I love you, Mama. I love you, darling. Come on, let's go. Come here. I love you, Mommy. I love you too, darling. Vader, what are you doing? Have you got Shin Sherman? No, not that I can recall. Well, I gotta keep looking. He's gone missing. What? Oh no. I know what happened to him, I think. Oh, okay. Blossom got dropped off here because they sold him to Winter and Amy. Oh. Well, that explains it, but I don't want to be in the fence alone anymore. Would you rather be with the drafters? No. And you're lucky you have a fence to yourself. You could turn around in. Yeah. <sighs> Darling, this is a fence. I love you. I love you too, Mama.